welcome people to back to Skyrim. To where I don't look very different, but I have a follower now. And as you can see, this is the house I live in, and I've been to the, you know, fall, Fallen Veil, or whatever you want to call it. I did the pir uh, Vampire DLC. So, I did that. But I haven't touched, like, story-wise. The vampire stuff wasn't really story. I do miscellaneous stuff. <clears throat> I stream it. And that's like just roaming around doing like the non-essentials, like the mages guild. That's optional to do. You really, you, you can play the game without even going over there and trying to do it. All the other stuff. But I do have an item. Is it with me or did I put it away? Put it away. Okay. But... Yeah, I just roam around doing miscellaneous stuff. I haven't touched any story. Besides going to Blackreach, I needed to go to Blackreach. If none of you know what Blackreach is, it's probably the best place in the game for me. It's so peaceful, and it's, like, unique, because it's the underbelly of Skyrim. I am a vampire, and one of the things is to go to uh, this place in front of me, which is the main mission of uh, there. I will also say I did kind of have to go to Raven, Raven's Rock, which is Dragonborn DLC, to do something for the vampires. <laughs> <coughs> but I didn't do anything campaign-wise. Besides them cultists, they came after me. I like this follower due to the fact I can't kill her. <laughs> I will state Lydia has died. Died for a good purpose. Getting me through Lebrithia. She died for that purpose. That's because I put her down. The fire bottle in the back of the head. Wasn't my wisest option. <laughs> Basically, for story-wise, I'm going to do stuff like kill Alduin, other stuff like that. I'm going to cut out, you know, me grab, me having to run around grab stuff. Oh, nope. Me having to run around grab stuff to build the character I want. <clears throat> Like running around grabbing spells, running around grabbing, you know, health potions or anything like that. And I heard somebody up here. You survived a fireball well, very well. <clears throat> I 
<clears throat> like I'll cut out working on smithing and leave those for streams and stuff. But I was always taught to avoid these types of ruins. I think I see why now. Why? Because it looks deadly. Thanks. I'll try. He didn't even make it over to me. Team. Okay, the thug just randomly dies. Over here. Yeah, I grab arrows even though I don't use them. It just makes me look cool. Yeah, somebody's here. Come meet your maker. Are you hurting me? Come on. I need my magic recovery even higher. I'm gonna go get the fucking the stone for that. Oh, okay, I knocked it out. That's great. It's good for me. I think down here is like a shitload of urns. Oh, no, it's a, uh... It's a soak right. To a door that's probably buried barred. Aha, uh -huh, no. It's this room. Oh, yes, that's what I'm looking for. Yeah, I'm just basically grabbing armor and enchanting it just for due fact that I can. I have nothing else to do with it. I could sell it. But then what's the point about playing a game if you don't have a goal if you don't have a goal? Meet your maker. I think I actually do need to bust up the difficulty if these are the druggers that keep coming at me. I'll determine that here in a couple of seconds. If the druggers don't serve quite a, you know, much of a challenge, I, might, I may actually have to uh, bump it up though. What I figured out is NPCs can roll. I 
found that out when freaking my NPC got stuck crouched and I walked so far she looked at me and rolled. I was like, huh? They can roll? Shit. Big sign factor is probably ah that. That uh, I only fight dragons. Totally doesn't make it look like I've played this game before or anything. Snipe that man without a purpose. But jeez. Got right to the face. Sparts. Uh, Orcish dagger. Yeah. I need crystals. How they put it so close. Oof. I could have hit multiple things to kill them. What? Who the? Why am I getting the good shots today? I like to thank you for the good shots, but I'm still just gonna walk waltz right across to it. No matter if you're showing me that, you know. Hey, the middle's fine. Really don't care. I have health regeneration in here. <laughs> Anywhere else, it's. It vanishes. Also seeming to forget something. I rarely just run in here for something. Uh, where is it? Yeah, it's on the other side of that. But how the fuck? Get it out. The fuck? 
fuck? How did we get in there? Wait a minute, it's probably down and over there. Yeah. Probably literally being stupid. Yeah, I'm correct. I was legit just being stupid. Now you learn another voice. I hope it's Call of the Storm, because by God, best shout. I wish there's an option in Skyrim <clears throat> that allows you to fight the war by yourself and just freedom for all. There's probably a mod for it, but you know, I, uh, I want my achievements because I don't know what I did or what I have not gotten. stupid for both ways because it's just over here. There's a skeleton. Do something, come here. What now? Follow me. Kind of make me do it, aren't you? You know what we do? We do this. We play a game called Never Touch the Fucking Floor Ever Again. Good shit, I mean.
look, I made it here again, just for a note. Yay! Notes! She's in an Eric stand. I think I've seen her once or twice. Ah, oh, gold. Kill the dragon, turn the horn. It's our plan. I can't turn into a dragon. I can't fucking turn into a vampire because I think she'll try to fucking kill me. Burns. Chest. Yeah, that's right. It was behind the door with the two. Shards. Ow, thank you for making me go faster, but ow. I hear like a whole bunch of knives going to my ass. Uh, you are in Rorikstead, wherever that is again. Uh, there it is. Hold, hold, hold up. Was she always in Riverwood? I haven't done this mission in so long. I think she was always in Riverwood. My brain. Hello. Other human. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. <laughs> sure I am. We got some furs and tree branches, paint them white, and then tie them to stumps. Instant frostbite spider. Frognar, nobody's gonna believe that your dog is a frostbite spider. And if they do, they'll kill him. That's not much of a prank. Oh yeah? And what would you rather do? How about we play tag? Hear it. Hey, look here! <laughs> They're walking. You're th I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room, but you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. And the braggart did swagger and brandish his blade as he told of both battles and gold he had made. 
but then he went so you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. Maybe. We need to talk. Oh, you talk and Follow you lie me. and you drink a lot of mead. Now I think it's high time that you, you lie, lie down and bleed. And so then came clashing and slashing of steel as the brave lass Matilda charged in full of zeal. And the braggart named Ragnar was boastful no more. As his fucking red head rolled around on the floor. As his fucking goddamn Close head rolled around on the floor. Now we can talk. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. <coughs> right. Surprise. <laughs> I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you're you. You're an to enemy! Out. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent and not some Thalmor plant. We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Tastes like spaghetti, but yeah. Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Pines Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. I take map. I take sword Let's wherever that is. Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. Let me get in travel gear, leather. Orgnar, I'm traveling. You've got the inn till I get back. Right. Happy trails. Hey. What now? <coughs> It'll help. It will. Here, you're gonna have a good weapon. I should have gave you your father's sword, but you know. Kynes Grove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Depends on how far Kynes Grove is. I mean, I'm, I may have to travel because I'm that cool. And I don't...
I want to know if there's actual people that actually just straight up walk and follow her. Not too much for. Hey, how's it going? This is where I'll travel with you. I should have traveled to Kynes Grove by myself and knew that this was coming. I doubt the Talner are aware of you yet, so we should be safe from them at least. That is a dragon. Wait, no, wrong. you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. Well, I don't know. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not Come waiting on, around to hurry. find out. We might be too late. Come on. We need to find out what's happening up there. Hi, Aldoan. That one tastes like grapes. I'm 
one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Really? Where? Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it. We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. Exactly. Nobody even remembers <coughs> our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone, though. Yeah, because one, the, the last, last one turned into a fucking dragon! Searching for the next dragonborn to guide and guard, Oop. as we are sworn to do. I owe you some answers, don't I? You bitch. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? You got a point. If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. <coughs> Got diplomatic immunity, so Hama, you can't sue. Oh yeah, if I don't do the Civil War... <sighs> I have to do that off camera. If I don't do the Civil War, it's gonna lead into the Greybeards, and then that. So if I do the Civil War before, and then continue this, I will have skipped over that. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Rincon. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. 
speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards, but you are ready. Tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. Sky, guard you. Ref uh, well, with that said. That's all the time I have for this one. I will see all of you fellow assassins later. And remember, nothing is true. Everything is permitted.